Hey everybody, how's it going? And welcome back. Thanks for watching Manny Scale Modeling. Uh, let's see, I got a couple, I got three shout outs. Um, an update on the 92 Silverado and a couple uh, 130 second scale actually. Um, older kits, vintage or whatever you know you want to call them. But um, let's start out with the shop card shout outs. And the first one is Joey's Hobby Shop. Awesome truck on the on the card there, Joey. Sweet. Uh, awesome channel. Awesome guy. Uh, thanks for the kind words and stuff on the back. And uh, I'll have his link um, below too. So go check him out. Uh, subscribe, like, comment. And uh, appreciate it. So we'll keep him right there. Then we got Fred Henry, West Georgia Rods and Customs. Look at that vet. That thing is sick. Fred does a lot of, uh, most of you all know, he does a lot of pro street stuff, which is awesome. That's my, uh, what I like to build too the most. But um, thanks for the kind words on the back, Fred. And uh, hopefully we can get you on a podcast here pretty soon, like we were talking about. And, uh talk some model stuff um i'll have his link below the video go check fred out and also got a cool sticker very cool sticker <clears throat> so we put that right there and we've got mike's mods and customs uh thanks for the kind words on the back mike um awesome channel awesome builds and uh go check mike out and i'll have his link below put him right there and a decal very cool like the decals uh awesome build guys awesome channels and uh you know definitely uh go check them out and stuff um it's very cool so uh the 92 Silverado, um, I'm, I don't remember if I said what I had an issue with last time. I can't remember now. Uh, I bought a can of uh, Krylon uh, paint primer at um, Hobby Lobby. And I had the body all washed and sanded, cleaned everything. And I sprayed it and then it kind of look like little puddles of fish eyes here and there on it and i'm like it's crazy i never had that happen with uh the krylon before so i tried it on um another body i had prepped and it did the same thing grabbed another can of krylon that i had and primed a camaro body real quick and it did the same thing or it was fine so it must have been something with that can so I wet sanded the hood all down, but you can still see, like right in here, I must not have sanded it down good enough. So I'm going to have to sand that down or strip it, basically, and uh, reprime the hood. But I did, I got the body all nice and clean. That body turned out really good. And um, so I got to get that. Uh, the hood fixed on there because I, I'm going to be painting this today, sometime later today or whatever. The box came out good, all nice and clean. Tailgate came out good. So I'm going to get those, uh, get the hood f repaired and um, cleaned up and uh, get the uh, testers color shift paint. Um, base put on later today um oh this is the primer i was using so i went and bought this at the hobby shop this stuff is awesome i mean it lays so lays down so good and i got the gray and um i think i got a red oxide one too that i grabbed a while back um all right guys so let me uh move some stuff around here and i'll be right back
Well, okay, just had to adjust the camera and move the truck over a little bit. So the first one is the uh, 32 custom pickup, Chevy custom pickup by Pyro, uh, 132nd scale. And I can't remember if this one had a year on it or not either. I keep forgetting to look that up before I grab it. Uh, I don't see a year on the box. No, nope, I don't see a year on it. Um, it's all there. I mean, it looks like it was uh, maybe kind of started. No, maybe not. No. Nope. Oh yeah, yeah. The window windows in the frame in there. Let me grab that out. Look. I had a rear windows in there too. It's uh, a little messed up, but could probably be cleaned up. You see that in there? Rear window. Cleaned up, or those are easy enough. You can make those too. That's not that big of a deal. Very simple. I wish there was a year on here. Made in New Jersey. I like the box art though. That's why I that's why I decided to keep them. Uh second one is 57 Chevy hardtop 132nd scale. <coughs> and uh no year. I should have looked for that before I did the video on them, but um, awesome box art though, just the old, you know, old box art is just awesome looking. So this one looks all there. And that started. And it's got the multi-piece uh, bodies and parts and stuff. <coughs> I'm sorry. Pretty cool, though. Um... I think this one I'm going to do a giveaway on it. So if uh, you want to try to win this, I'm going to do a comment picker. Um, just comment below. Uh, pyro kit or something. Something having to do with the 57 Chevy. And uh, you'll be... Or just, just comment, period, I guess. And uh, I'll get this shipped out to you. Even just the box art is cool. I really like that one too. Especially uh 57 Chevy. But um yeah, be a cool little giveaway just to get an old box art if you don't have one. So that's uh that's pretty much it guys. Um I was gonna make a short one today, so I'll be doing a podcast uh later on too that'll be on my um website which i'm still working on and the link is up and everything i just gotta i'm waiting to change the the domain name so once i get that changed then i'll start posting it on my uh, facebook page and my um under my youtube videos here and stuff and the descriptions and all that but uh if you are interested in listening to them i mean they're only like 10 to 12 minutes long maybe just quick brief updates and stuff um you know send me a email or something i'll send you the link to the to the page where the podcasts are and uh check them out i guess um so everybody thanks for watching and uh hopefully the next video here i'll have the truck at least the base coat done on it of the color shift paint and I got a few more videos I have I've been working on. I just haven't finished them up yet. And uh, I'll be getting to those soon too. So thanks for watching everybody and subscribing. And, you know, always like the likes and uh, the comments. I try to get to everybody as soon as I can. And just been really busy here working. And uh, all this rain we got, we've been getting. It's just the, the grass is just growing insane. Uh, but there you go. 
So check out Mike and Fred and Joey's uh, YouTube channels too if you haven't already. And thanks for watching, guys.